Another way to apply effects to your instruments is to create an aux send. By creating aux sends, we can divide how much dry signal we would like to process. It also cuts down on CPU usage because you can send multiple instruments through one aux send instead of creating multiple instances of one effect. In order to do this, we just have to add an effect to one of our aux channels. Let's choose a delay for aux channel 1. Let's make sure to set up our output accordingly. Now we can toggle our aux ends under our instruments in the multi-rack. Moving the sliders determine how much your instrument's drive signal will get sent through the effect. If we keep the slider all the way to the left, no signal is sent. If we move it to the middle, some signal gets sent. And if we move it to the far right, all of the signal gets sent. This allows for variability when determining how much effect you want on your sound. Properly setting up aux sends is crucial to getting the right sound. Please complete the following assignment. 